Dr. Charles E. Brim was born in Philadelphia on May 24th of 1924. His legacy begins and ends in Camden, New Jersey. Dr. Charles E. Brim received his primary and secondary educations in the city of Camden, graduating from Camden High in 1942. Upon graduation, he took his talents to the Army for three years, then returned back to Camden to enroll in South Jersey Law School, Rutgers Camden Law School, as of today. He moved to Ottawa, Canada, successfully attaining his Bachelor's of Science in a degree in medicine from the University of Ottawa over a course of seven years. Dr. Charles E. Brim specialized in family medicine and family practice with his med medicine degree. Dr. Charles E. Brim's public service proves him to be a true humanitarian. In 1956, Dr. Charles E. Brim returned to the city of Camden and began his practice in family medicine on 514 Keynes Avenue. He provided medical care in Camden for a whopping 41 years. 41 years. In the 70s, his prime time, Dr. Brim took the initiative to resolve the drug epidemic that doomed the residents of Camden. He built the Concept House, a drug rehabilitation center that redeemed many lives of drug addicts at the time. Dr. Brim became aware that Camden residents needed something more, something more grand to their health or their wellness. So he suggested primary care centers. He and Emily Doerr cooperated and founded Camp Care Health, an organization with the mission to provide primary care and mental health care services. Camp Care also sponsored a housing project nicknamed Dr. Charles E. Brim Community Homes. This was permanent residence for his clients in need of service. Dr. Charles E. Brim received many awards and honors. The Public Service Institute Award, the Cooper Foundation Distinguished Healthcare Professional Award. He was also elected by the Queen of England as an affiliate of the Royal Society of Medicine. His concern for welfare of Camden residents was evident. Again, in the 70s, his prime time, Dr. Charles Ebram served as a city councilman. Dr. Charles Ebram was staff of Cooper, Our Lady of Lourdes, and Virtual Hospitals. He taught and lectured at nearby universities, such as the College of Medicine and Dentistry of New Jersey, Thomas Jefferson, Temple, and Hahnemann. Dr. Charles E. Brim retired in 1997, but still made his way to Dr. Charles E. Brim Medical Arts to appeal to the new generation and to share some insight of what his life was like and give a deep understanding of what he was all about. And for that, we honor him and honor his work ethic and legacy.